this will look so good with black leggings so they can see the detail of the long sides at the sides. Long sides at the sides? Meron bang long sides at the center? <sighs> This is Charlotte, your magically recovering shopaholic in today's episode, which is something that you probably are never expecting. Yes, because we are still in the middle of the pandemic, and yet, why do I have a Tai Tai haul video? Did I go there myself? Of course not. We are not risking that for the sake of fashion. So what's going on? Yes, this is footage from a Yay Tai Tai or Nay Patai episode that has been put into the shelf. So to all of you who are new here, this is a series that I created where I purchase clothing and fashion items from Tai Tai Changge, which we fondly call Tay Tay Tianjie here on this channel for my subscribers based on what they need, based on their style that they tell me about, and based on their budget. If they like what I bought for them, they are going to say yay, tai tai. And if they don't like what I bought for them, they're going to say nay, pat tai. Uh-huh, the thumbnail was not a clickbait. My bombshell stopped talking to me when I sent her the items. <laughs> Yes, that's true. She stopped talking to me when I sent her her haul. And it's safe to say that probably all of these items are nay patay for the subscriber that I bought it for. But it's such a waste of footage, so I thought you might want to see it because I know that you only come out of your holes and watch me when it's a Tai Tai Changge haul. Am I right? Yes! I know you so well. And no, I'm probably just being overly dramatic. She probably was just very busy to reply back to me or probably really shy to tell me that she did not like the items that I chose for her or probably did not fit or probably was not something that she would wear. So she just ghosted me. <laughs> but it's highly likely that she was just really busy and did not see my messages. Oh my gosh, guys, as I was editing this, I still had blonde hair in the film and I still spoke as if I was high on 10 kilos of kaping barako. <laughs> Undiluted kaping barako. It's as if I chugged the kaping barako straight from the pack without water. <laughs> Ang ingay ko pala guys. Ang ingay ko pala back then. Now I'm more subdued and more toned down and more behaved. But back then, I'm so sorry for all of the clips. I'm so sorry for all of the videos where I was screaming at your screens. <laughs> you know, you only realize it when you've taken a step back and you haven't seen yourself for a while in that state of energy. And I'm like, I'm a girl. <laughs> Maybe because this was footage from such a long time ago that I'm already a changed woman. <laughs> anyway, enjoy my screaming. Let's roll the clip. Hi everybody, this is Charlotte, your artistically recovering shopaholic in today's Tai Tai haul part. Woo! And yay Tai Tai or nay Patai episode. Woo! The subscribers edition. Yes. Woo! Let's pull out notes. And her notes say that her budget is 3,500 and she is a size 3XL to 5XL. She needs formal wear or office wear. She likes girly girl outfits, black, pink, and she dislikes unflattering silhouettes. We can relate much. So here we go, all the items, the Chang guest stall numbers, and the prices will be listed in the description box below. Let's go and see! The first item is this 120 peso high low top that is super cottony soft material. And although some may consider this as a basic cotton top, I think it makes an impact because of the color and because of this detail. From 120 pesos, we are moving on to 130 pesos to this Aztec print over laptop with long sides. It is pink and black, two of her favorite colors. And I specifically like the neckline because you can either expose or pretend to be the Lagam Filipina, yeah. From 130, we are moving on to 140 pesos. And this is this vertical striped romper with pockets and peekaboo detail at the back. You often see me buying rompers for my subscribers because I'm running out of things to buy for them. <laughs> and no, I'm just kidding because in my own personal experience, rompers or jumpsuits or pantsuits are the easiest things to wear when you have no time to think about fashion at the moment. And 
because I love the material and the print of that one, I got her another one with a slight variation. This instead has a bakuna detail. This is again a romper. This time, it's a combination of blue and yellow, which is one of my personal favorite color combinations. From those 140 peso rompers, we are moving on to this 150 pesos red cowl neck top. The color is so vibrant. The cowl neck detail is so yayamanin. And you can pair this with all kinds of bottoms like your basic office slacks of all colors and your jeans. From that red cowl neck top, we are moving on to another 150 peso item to this black and white vertical striped dress with bakuna detail and ruffles on the sleeve and ruffles at the hem. I would personally accessorize this with a red belt and red stiletto heels and that would make for such powerful dressing everybody would call you ma'am. Add red lipstick on top of all of that and everyone will call you madam. Wow. Madame, madaming utos. <laughs> From that 150 peso black and white dress, we are moving on to another 150 peso black and white dress, but this time squares, tic tac toe. So just like the other black and white dress, I would suggest that you accessorize this with a colored belt. Something bright, something loud like yellow or turquoise and or punchy colored shoes or in the earrings. I think they call this silhouette a shift dress when it's just like straight and loose. From this black and white dress, we are moving on to another black and white dress. Sorry. The choices are so obviously Mrs. F. This next one is a black and white polka dotted overlap front dress. I personally love overlapping necklines because I get to show an unreasonable amount of cleavage. We are moving on from black and white dresses and we are going to navy blue and this is this beautiful summer smock dress with a high low hem. This detail where the garter makes it look all rumpled up is called a smock detail and I love that because it reminds me of summer dresses. From navy blue we are moving on to teal blue and this is another 180 peso dress. This time it has ruffled sleeves and this to me is a beautiful office dress because of the color and because of the detail here on the sleeves. From 180 we are moving on to 190 pesos to this black pantsuit with tie detail at the front. I am so sold on a basic black pantsuit. Even more sold with this tie detail. You can wear this with a white top inside but for the perfect black and white Chanel outfit and you can punch it up with colors. We are moving on to another 190 peso outfit to this navy blue dress with two pockets and tie detail. I love this dress because it reminds me of Korean fashion. I would personally wear this dress with something high necked and long sleeves and of course with this silly clips on my head. From 190 pesos, we are moving on to this 200 peso green long back top. The color in person is just so vibrant and attractive. I would personally wear this with black leggings or jeggings and violet or purple accessories. Let me tell you, green and purple, they work so well together. From 200 pesos, we're moving on to another 200 pesos to this old rose cowl neck dress. Cowl necklines are like the fun sister of turtleneck. From 200 pesos, we are moving on to this 230 peso tie-dye top. This is 230 pesos because this is export overruns and the price says $42. I love the tie-dye design of this. This looks so fresh and summer and breezy. And I also like the peekaboo of the sleeves. If they had this in my size, I would have bought one for myself and worn it with white shorts. From 230 pesos, we are moving on to 250 pesos to this yellow lace dress. I personally love lace. Some people think it's a little old. But if you pair it with a fun, bright color like this, it is not old. It's gold. That yellow lace dress was 250 pesos, so I got her another one in 250 pesos as well. This time in red. What? I love lace. And this time another punchy color like red. The vision here is to make lace dresses younger, put it in a very vibrant color, and accentuate it with also more vibrant colors. I really love lace because I feel like it's vintage style, but when you put it in pops of colors like these, it's modern vintage. From 250 pesos, we are moving on to this. 300 peso black and white maxi dress. This is another export overrun and it says $65. Ka-ching! 
ka ching ching the savings! This one has built-in pads and a sexy back. I would wear this on its own. You can wear this with a white shirt inside and sneakers. Or throw in a black cardigan. And the price says 65. Hopefully not rupees. I think it's dollars US. We are down to our last two items and this is a 300 peso denim dress. I think this is another export overrun because it has a brand and the brand is Torrid. Torrid. <laughs> I love denim dresses because it reminds me so much of guest jeans and guest jeans means expensive. And soft denim feels so good in the body versus denim jeans which is why I don't really wear them. We are down to our final item and this is this 300 peso striped dress with tie detail. Now you don't need to find a belt anymore. It has a belt for you. And this is also an export overrun. The brand is Sonoma. Sonoma, goods for life. I love this. I've, I'm running out of descriptions. I love this because... I love this just because... I love this just because, just because I do. So this dress features textured vertical stripes. And I know you might not be able to see the beauty of this on screen, but the material paired with how it is made is just so elegant and classy. Pair this with a brown... <laughs> This is such a versatile dress, which is why I love it so much. And there you have it, everybody. Those were 20 items. Her grand total is 3,910 pesos. 410 pesos over budget. Don't worry, I got her approval first before overspending. Thank you, beloved F Bombshells, for continuously watching. And don't forget to watch all my other Tai Tai Hall videos. There are a lot. You will need a whole day. There you have it everybody. Thank you so much for watching and I know that you are such a fan of Tai Tai and I was wondering what else you would like to see. How do I make you happy in the same way my Tai Tai hauls have made you happy when we don't have Tay Tay Tian J right now? Let me know in the comment section down below. I will really appreciate any leads as to what kind of videos you would like to see from me. I was, I've been contemplating on doing a K-drama review channel <laughs> because I have started binging on K-drama ever since the pandemic started and I want to have a reason and I want to justify my binge watching by having like something good come out of it like something productive come out of my binge watching are you gonna be interested in something like that like we talk about the killing scenes and we talk about what we thought of the characters if you, there are channels that you already watch with that kind of content please let me know down below so I can check them out myself thank you everybody for watching and I truly miss you I truly miss you and I miss Tay Tay Tianjie and I miss just hauling in Tay Tay Tianjie, but I hope that you're staying safe and sane wherever you are. Bye, everybody. Mwah. Oh, hey, Mrs. F. Daming paklip. Di na ko pa ang Marcela's boutique. Mukha na ba akong hair clip? And welcome to this series that I created wherein I buy my subscribers. Subscribers. And welcome to this series that I have created wherein I buy my subscribers clothes from Tai Tai. And if they like what I... Because this cinches... From 130, we are moving on to 140 pesos to this black and white vertical stripe with blue... And you can pair this with all kinds of... Navy blue is a self-matching color when it comes to fashion. Fashion. Fashion, that chon. Pair this with brown leather goods like a brown pa pars. Pa pars. Pars. This is such a versatile dress. Dress. This is such a ver ver uh. Hi everybody, this is Charlotte, your artistically recovering shopaholic in today's Tai Tai Hall part. Woo! And a yay Tai Tai or nay pa Tai episode. Yeah! Yeah! Sino ka?